tutorial on Katy Perry's ET uh, Warrior look. Um, I got so many requests for this. It's it's insane. Like I got emails, I got messages, I got comments. Will you do an ET look? And after that, I couldn't say no. So today I did the warrior look. Um, that was my favorite part of the entire video. The video was kind of mad-ish to me, um, but I loved the extra singing part where she started like, no, 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 no. Today I'm doing this ET look. And um, if you want to know how I did this, then please keep on watching. So the first thing we're going to do are the brows and uh, the colors I'm going to use for that are Omega eyeshadow by MAC and charcoal brown. So with the Omega I'm just going to like put some darkness on the front like the beginning of my eyebrows just to make it more defined. So once you reach the end, straight out and up. Now with Omega, I just kind of make a brow shape into it, then just one line. Now I'm going to take a brush like this and just kind of make it softer at the beginning. I'm going to take some Makeup Studio Brow Gel and just brush the hairs up for a more uh, kind of like warrior look. And then with that brush again, brush them in place, how you want them to end up staying up. And then I'm just going to take some concealer and pop that right under the brow to make it more defined. I already applied a base to my lids to prevent the eyeshadow from creasing or like anything that is going on top to not crease. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a MAC 266 and we're going to cut the crease like really extremely and cut the crease is like the brown line that is right there and for that I'm going to grab um, Embark, Embark by MAC I'm just going to take it and with that you kind of want to go up well not kind of go a lot above your crease and then go all the way to the bridge of your nose I'm gonna take my Sigma E45 and I'm gonna go into Max uh, Swiss Chocolate. What I'm gonna do is just blend above that line, just create depth. Go up in a straight line. And right here, just make it nice and dark and as if it is really like deep set. I can kind of blend above this part right here as well. Doesn't really matter. I like it. Now I'm going to take this uh, Makeup Studio 18 color uh, eyeshadow palette. And I'm going to take this MAC 239 and I'm going to go into the white. And I'm going to apply that all over the lid and to these inner fake corners. Okay, now I'm going to add the like white thing she has on her eyes. I'm going to use Ilma Masco's uh, eye pencil in Elate. And what you want to do is kind of like draw uh, ovals. So it aren't really like circles, just like ovals. One at the brow right here. I kind of make the outline first and then fill them in. Here. And with that white eyeshadow from the Makeup Studio palette, set it. So just set it with a white eyeshadow. Now with the Swiss chocolate, kind of make that brown fade into the spaces between the white for more uh, dimension into this look. Once you have that on, it's time for the eyeliner and the bottom part. Um, what you want to do is just uh, with the 226 from MAC and some black track fluid line create an eyeliner then wing it out extremely 
extremely and then from the bottom connected to the top. Okay, once you have the eyeliner on, you're going to take some brushes and uh, embark again and Swiss chocolate and you want to uh, make those shadows go from the point of the line all the way into that point. So you kind of get like that elongated cat eye look. And just kind of place it there. Just kind of look where you need it and go all the way to that other line right here. Now take a big brush like that and go in and bark again and then make that eyeshadow meet up with the eyeliner and wing out as well. Now I'm going to take a Sigma 219 and I'm going into uh, Swiss chocolate as I said and smoke it out even more but then with the Swiss chocolate. I'm going into the black and really make that inner corners really dark and then make it go to the embark and then make it go to the Swiss chocolate so you really have those inner corners like black dark brown Swiss chocolate. Um, I'm gonna apply some mascara uh, I'm gonna use the Colossal Volume Express by Maybelline and some lashes which are the um, makeup studio number four for the brown um, print right here. I'm gonna take um, uh, Urban Decay's uh, Whiskey Eye Pencil and then set it with Embark eyeshadow. Um, for the green I used um, Stash by Urban Decay and I set it with um, Cork eyeshadow from MAC. And then for uh, this was all brown too, but I wanted some color into it. Um, for the orange, I used Illamasqua's Rodi uh, pencil. So Katy Perry kind of like those medium dark brown lips. Um, I'm going to be honest here, if I apply medium brown to my lips, I will look like I ate shit. I'm not kidding. I will look like I ate poo. So instead of the brown lips, I added some like pastel-y, pinky, sweetie lips to make this more appropriate for my face. Um, what I use um, is Naked Lip Liner, which is the bomb. Like uh, next to my uh, lip erase, I found my new love, which is Naked Lip Liner. And then another new love is um, Playing Koi Lipstick from the Quite Cute Collection from MAC to die for. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions leave them in the comment section below. Uh, I made a list with all products used on my website nikitutorials.com and uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. So I love you and hopefully I will see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye!